Hey guys, in this video we will see how to jailbreak the uh, fourth generation of the iPad. Uh, this technique also applies to the iPhone 5 as well as the iPad mini. So first thing you need to do was the, is to download the um, Evasion jailbreak from the Evasion website. I'll put the links down in the description. And uh, you need to make sure that you don't have any password lock enabled on your device. So the first step is to uh, start the evasion software on a Windows PC um, so ri just right click on the file and run it as administrator and uh, once you have connected your device the software will recognize the version of the device and will tell us whether it's supported or not so all you need to do is just click on that jailbreak button and uh, this is the longest of all steps retrieving the information from the uh, device and it only takes about like a minute or so and uh, all the other steps should be very short so we are waiting on it to recognize the uh, device and retrieve the information from the device This procedure is for a Windows PC and uh, the software is pretty much the same for a Mac OS as well. So yeah, uh, it's started its uh, steps, the first stage of injecting the uh, jailbreak data. And after this first step, it reboots your device and make sure not to do anything while you do this any sort of virus tasks like opening up the uh, iTunes or anything so just leave it as it is and uh, we're waiting on it to reboot and there is a second stage of injecting the jailbreak data can actually hear the uh, sounds in the background my device plugged in, getting plugged and unplugged while the process is happening. So it started the second stage of the uh, jailbreak process. Uh, it's finished injecting the data and it's actually uploading the CD now. So what it wants you to do now is just go to your device and you would be seeing a jailbreak icon. You just need to open it once. Remember guys, only once. We're getting a black splash screen and that's it. Be sure to touch it only once. It's almost done guys and um, it's on the final stage and it should say exit so after this step you're sh you can go ahead and close off this program on your Windows PC and everything would be done on your iPad itself or on your iOS device so let's see what's going on with the device so you can see that uh, the device actually reboots itself multiple times before it actually starting up uh, the device So first time, it's rebooting the first time, and it's doing cleaning up, 
and that there's one last step after which it was is ready and jailbroken. Yep, looks like the iPad is ready to use and it's uh, let's see if it all is jailbroken or not I can see the lightning connector connected which says that the iPad is the uh, fourth generation so you can see oh there's another app as well uh, it wasn't included previously with the iPad only for the iPhone so if you open up the CD app for the first time it prepares you the file system which clearly tells that the iPad is now jailbroken after this it might just restart the springboard I'm waiting to show you guys that this actually works and the CDS yes starts okay so it has restarted it and you should be able to open up the CDI again and you should be getting the uh, startup screen for the CDI. Just need to click user and done. And you should get the beautiful welcome screen of the CDI. Yep, there you go guys and um, yeah, that's it for this video and um, yeah, be sure to thumbs up, like the video, comment if you have any questions.